Well, day three, our sun finally came out. We got rid of the clouds. More of the favorable weather for this lake that we have here. Kurt's gonna start with the same bucktail that he caught his fish on last night. Luke is still throwing top water. And I don't know exactly what I'm gonna throw yet. But we're thinking our chances are pretty good today. We got a major right around 9.30. And we'll see if we can poke the one bite that we're looking for. Oh my god, it's T-boned. That was cool. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> First spot of the day. <laughs> Very cool. Fucking uh, right as it started to come just <laughs> Definitely digging that bucktail. That was a good make. Nice, nice. Look at you, you pretty little delight. T boned. Cool. Couldn't even get to the corner. Just. <laughs> oh, his sweet. tail kick out here on that outside yeah. turn is pretty. That was cool. That, that was amazing. super cool. Focus down trick. His tail kick was really awesome. <laughs> Gonna crush that thing. Come here, little babies. He's gonna be fine. I think he's gonna be alright. I was amazed my 55 fit in the net that we had. Bought Boat. a big kahuna after my big, my biggest, longest. There you go, buddy. What's up? That was so cool. That was awesome. <laughs> I watched that thing come up on your bucktail and then in. It was just laying right there. Like I thought it was a pike at pike. first. That was sweet. That was. This is a cool spot. This is where I caught my first 50 inch muskie in 2007, early July. And funny enough, Luke has also caught muskies on this same spot. But where doesn't Luke catch muskies? <laughs> no, it, it, it skied with it. Here comes one. I still like this spot. <laughs> the fish never even really made it out of the first turn, did it? I went to cut it off. Yeah, I think honestly, if you would have just like just given it a little bit of a better chance to get it that first turn, it came then... in, and then like as soon as you started turning, turning, then jetted, then ripped it, it kind of went like, kind of half ass. You ripped it so fast in the second turn that the fish could just like it just it was, like it lost, lost it. it. Yep. Got it. But it's a perfect ball because they've also they can also accelerate into that. Yeah, first or second, either one of those. Mm -hmm. Yep. How in the fuck did you miss that? You got it. This is 
despite the extreme clarity down here. He's still there. He's still there. That was big. What's that? that was big. That was one of those ones with the big, the big rubber lips. And the big head. Yeah. I think that these fish are just crazy old. This one. Oh. Oh. That was awesome. I just saw the tail on that one, but it looks super nice. Oh, it looks like a sweet high 40. Thanks for finally letting one get back to me. <laughs> that was a lot of water that got moved when she took off. It's that. I think that that's a little one. Nice! Plus one! A little tiger? No. That's kind of what I was thinking. Because it almost looked like, like, what like is a. That? Like, I think that's a little one. <laughs> <laughs> High fives on the easy muskie. Nice, uh, nice spot selection. Wonderful figure eight. That yeah, might be a tiger. It's silvery enough. It's very silver. It is. That was like a bass guy. Uh, I power pulled. Oh. <laughs> John, that was John Clear. Yeah, that was a straight up bass pull. Freaking oh, cool chase, though. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't seen enough black cool fish to like. Hey guys, uh, just want to thank you if you've made it this far in the video. I appreciate you guys watching the stuff. I make it for you, and hopefully, you guys are liking this series. Uh, I've got a couple fish I'm going to show you here that we didn't actually capture on camera. The one, I don't really know what happened to it, and the other one uh, was just after dark and there was no camera light, and we just wanted to get the fish back in the water and get her back doing her thing. So, the one fish Kurt caught uh, just out from the boat, the daytime one, and then the one fish the night, um, I think was kind of the same thing out on the cast, but both really nice fish. Uh, that one in the dark was, was really, really cool. I still have to show you guys yet, it'll be the next video the biggest fish I've ever captured on camera. It's an absolute freak. I'm really looking forward to showing that to you guys and I apologize for not uploading lately. Guiding has been ridiculously crazy and I have to thank you guys for that too. I have a lot of subscribers that come out and fish with me which is awesome. Um, but if you guys want to get out in the boat with me for either walleyes, bass, or muskies since it does open up here this week, uh, let me know. Shoot me a message on Instagram or Facebook and hopefully I can get you guys out in the water.